Okay, so Erica from Girly Things here, and I am um, doing a um, post or a vi and video um, to participate in a Hasty Life's um, blog crawl where she basically asked 100 bloggers to um, all blog about the same thing. And she gave us all, um, I think it's a period of two weeks, so and each one of us got assigned a day um, where we all pretty much talk about the same thing. So my day is today, Wednesday, January 19th, um, and I will be sharing the contents of my purse with you. Um, so the blog post is called, It's in the Bag, and it's essentially the same as the YouTube um, tag that was, uh, what's in my purse? So here is my bag. It is a green, to light quilted J. Crew purse that I got, um, I think about two years ago, um, and I believe it was part of either their fall or winter, ooh, part of their fall or winter line, um, and I just, I was drawn to the color. Um, most of my purses always end up being black or brown. Um, I always, I'm drawn to the color, the purses with the nice color, but then I'm always, I always wonder whether or not I'll get a lot of use out of them. Um, and I gotta say, I've used this one quite a bit, um, and um, I'm not sure why I haven't bought any more color purses, um, but I plan to definitely in the future. But this is it. It's uh, pretty big and roomy and spacey, and that's why I like it because I, I just I can't do little bags. I I can't. I have I I feel like I carry everything in the kitchen sink. Um, although you guys have lucked out because. It was a new year, so therefore I kind of cleaned out my purse. So it's not that bad right now compared to, you know, uh, how it was in December. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and go through the contents of my purse for you. My phone. So my handy iPhone. It goes everywhere with me. Um, I am so attached to it. It's ridiculous. Um, a mirror that I got from Sephora. It's nice to have this in your purse. A pen. I always have a pen. I otherwise have a bad habit of walking away with people's pens, especially cashier's pens. So I always keep my own pen. Plus, I um, I like, to, I just like to have it on me. Um, so when you go to the bank, if you have to fill anything, I very rarely go to the bank, but on a few occasions when I have to go deposit something through the ATM and I need to fill or need to fill something out, I like to have a pen on me in the car. And when I'm at the grocery store, I use it to cross things off the grocery list. An appointment card for my next brow wax. My latest grocery list with things crossed off of it, as you can see. Um, I don't think I've thrown it away because there's still some things that I need to get. Um, a receipt from this weekend. We went to a barbecue place for dinner and uh, it's my receipt. Gum. Love spearmint gum. It's my favorite, favorite, favorite. Love spearmint gum. Nobody wants to have bad breath. In the same arena, I'll mint. Carmex. If you all have read my post about Carmex, you know just how much I love this stuff. Um, good for the lips, good for the cuticles, great little multi-purpose, multitasking product. Deodorant. Um, I like to keep one of these in my purse um, because you just never know when you're going to need it. You just never know when you're going to accidentally forget to put some on. Um, I don't know how it's happened, but it's happened to me where I'll like throw on a tank top and um, not want to get deodorant on it. So I'll put the tank top on first and to put the deodorant on after I put on the tank top and then start doing something, run out the door and realize, oh my God, I forgot my deodorant. So always good to carry a travel size one of these. I also used to like to keep one in my uh, gym bag to, you know, reapply deodorant before I go work out. This is a fun one. Feminine products, because you can never be too prepared. <laughs> I think these are pretty self-explanatory. I've got two pairs of gloves in my purse right now because it's been really cold uh, these past few days and um, I like to keep my hands warm. Eucerin Plus Hand Hand Lotion, Intensive Repair Hand Cream. This stuff is awesome. It's non-greasy, um, it's great for dry skin, um, 
and it's especially nice right now in the winter when your skin gets super duper dry my coupon book my coupon book is full of full of coupons if you have been reading my blog lately having this little coupon book with all these coupons in it has saved me and ooh, there's marley hi he's made a film debut again um i clip coupons and it has been immensely helpful with my cvs hauls and purchases because i got a lot of products for next to nothing car keys sunglass case here's my sunglasses inside so this is one pair these are my michael kors sunglasses that I got a few, actually got these maybe two years ago as well. Um, I don't know, I just really like them. I like the big sunglasses. Um, and I like that they're brown. I like that they're not super duper dark. Um, I also have a pair of Ray-Ban, what are those called? Oh, um, aviator glasses, but they're not in my purse right now. My wallet which actually doesn't get a whole lot of use because you'll see why in a minute um but it's my michael kors black wallet that i got the same day that i got my sunglasses and actually got a bag that day too um it was a few christmases ago and that was my christmas present to myself that year um but this has a ridiculous amount of junk in it this is actually something i have not cleaned out yet um because of the during the new year but we got you know Credit cards, discount cards, insurance cards, receipts. There's cash in there somewhere. I don't usually keep cash in here, but I have cash in here today. And the reason that I don't use it very much is I have one of these two. I find this is from Coach that I got at the factory store, and there's you know, some cash and receipts in there. My driver's license. Credit cards, gift cards. Um. And I like these little things because I don't always want to carry the big wallet everywhere I go. So say if I um, am going to the gym and I just have my gym bag, I just grab this out of my purse, throw it in my gym bag so I don't have to carry everything. Um, I do that um, a lot when if I'm going anywhere and I don't really want to carry my whole purse. My makeup and goodie bag. So let's see what I keep inside here. I got this at um, Walmart or Target or something. Ooh, I just got these. So this, the little container with my Tweezerman. It has two Tweezerman tweezers. So they have this one, which is the one with the pointy nozzles. And then this one, or pointy tips. And then this one, which is with the, nor it's like a normal, the slanted tips. And I just got these at TJ Maxx. And both of them with the kit, with the case, were $16.99, which is a steal because if you have seen Tweezerman tweezers um, anywhere else, they are, for one of them, they are at least $20. So to get two Tweezerman tweezers for less than $20 is a really, really good deal. And um, the reason these are so awesome is one, they're super sharp and they, um, have a lifetime um, sharpening warranty. So if they ever go dull, you can send them back to Tweezerman and they will sharpen them for you. Got a lip gloss. This is my, ooh, what is on it? Ew. My e.l.f. Hyper Shine lip gloss. And this one is in Honey. It's one of my favorite colors. It's a beautiful um, kind of goldish nude. Uh, more lip products. This is from One Natural Shea Butter Lip Balm in Cocoa Coconut. I love all things coconut, so there it is, just a lip balm. It smells, oh, it smells so good, and it tastes really good, so you put it on your lips and you end up having to reapply all the time because you end up just licking it off. Elf Blotting Papers, more lip gloss. Um, my sister gave this to me for Christmas, um, I think year before last year, um, and there it was like a set of five and they're from date they're called day to night lip plumping gloss and i love this color it's like a pinky peachy nude with gold shimmer in it it's really really pretty 
And every time I wear it, people are always like, oh, what lip gloss is that? And I have to show them because <laughs> I don't even know where you get this. She, I think, found it at TJ Maxx um, last year or the year before and gave them to me. I've never, I've never seen them anywhere else. Hair ties, more lip gloss. So yes, um, when it comes to the makeup that I carry with me, it's usually lip related because I don't like to carry a lot of makeup on me in my purse. I just, I don't know why. I've just never really been very good at it. Um, sometimes I'll carry a, a compact, but it's really rare. Um, I'd rather just, you know, use blotting papers and go if I have to go somewhere after work or anything like that and I know that I'm gonna have to touch up my makeup then I'll bring something but otherwise for every day I don't um, I just bring lip gloss so this is my beauty F beauty rush hyper sorry beauty rush minty lip shine with spearmint oil so we've already um, said I love spearmint my travel size urban decay lip lipstick and midnight cowboy so that's like it's like a nudie it's like a nude color with gold flecks but you can hardly see it it's almost it's right there see you can hardly see it it's almost like a um i don't know it's really sheer and it just kind of gives your lips a little bit of a glossy shine oh i love this my nars lip gloss and this color is in dolce vita vita the beautiful pinkish mauve right there I love NARS lip gloss they are they're just so luxurious I mean they're super nicely pigmented um, they're thick they're creamy they're they're just awesome I got this at TJ Maxx so I got it at a fraction of the price than you would at a retail store I don't know how much I paid for it it was a while ago uh, Burt's Bees Replenishing Lip Balm. So see, I carry a lot of lip balms and lip gloss. Elf Nail Polish Remover Pads, because you just, you know, you never know when you're going to need them. They're like these little individual pads, which like eye makeup remover pads. See? Except it has um, nail polish remover, um, you know, for when you have a chip and you just can't stand looking at it, you just take your nail polish off. Victor and Rolf Flower Balm Roll On Perfume. Uh, I love to smell good and this perfume smells good and so I carry it in my purse. It's great for travel. It's great for just keeping it around. It's just, see you have a little roller ball. So you just apply and you're good to go. So that is in my purse. Feminine cleansing cloth. Again, this is a, I think this is one of those self-explanatory things. I like to keep these in my purse for, you know, that time of the month because I like to stay clean. So, you know carry those in there you have to be prepared um so that is it that is what is inside my purse um yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed it and um we'll read the rest of my blog where i talk a little bit more about things in my purse and um what i think my purse says about me and what i think the contents of my purse say about me um uh, so anyway i uh, hope you enjoyed it and i will talk to you again soon bye